Update your bedroom by making your very own headboard. It's easier than you think. You'll need an MDF frame cut to the width of your bed, spray adhesive, tape measure, pencil, scissors, roller, staple gun and half inch staples, heavy linen fabric, batting, and foam. Cut foam to size with scissors and piece together. We used a thicker foam to give the headboard a more substantial look. Spray adhesive to the front of the MDF piece. Lay the foam on top and press it down with a roller to help it stick more evenly to the MDF. Add additional pieces of foam to cover the frame and adhere. Place the headboard face down on a piece of batting. Trim as needed. Be sure to leave enough to wrap around the foam and over the edge of the MDF. Staple the batting onto the MDF. Gently adjust and pull firmly each time you staple. The trick to smooth batting is to place a staple on one side and then a staple on the opposite side, rather than working down one side at once. Continue stapling around all the edges. Save the corners for last, notching out a square on the corners. Staple one side and roll over the raw edge of the other side and staple into place. Iron your fabric so your headboard will be wrinkle free and then lay it flat on the floor. Place the headboard on top of the fabric, leaving enough on all sides to wrap around the back. Pull one side tightly and staple, then move to the other side and staple like you did with the batting. Trim excess fabric as necessary. Repeat on all sides and fill in with more staples until the front side is smooth. For the corners, cut a notch like you did on the batting. Pull over one side and staple in place. Fold over the raw edge of the other side and staple into place. By folding over the raw edge, you create a nice clean pleat. Secure your headboard to the wall behind your bed and enjoy your DIY work. <laughs>